PM Trudeau, other leaders condemn white supremacy in wake of Trump's refusal to do so. Here's a summary of the article. Ottawa, U.S. President Donald Trump refused to condemn white supremacy during his debate against former U.S. Vice President Joe Biden on Tuesday. Now, Canada's political leaders are all speaking out against the issue of white supremacy, one that many acknowledged is present in Canada too. The Prime Minister has condemned and will continue to condemn right-wing extremism, white supremacy and racism in all its forms, read a statement from Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's office, sent to CTV News. Conservative leader Aaron O'Toole echoed the clear condemnation of white supremacy. I categorically condemn white supremacy and all forms of hate. In the military, I served all Canadians. Now as leader, I continue to serve all Canadians, he said in a statement sent to CTV News. The far-right group Trump refused to condemn was first founded in Canada and has since taken root in the United States, which is something interim Green Party leader Joanne Roberts made a point to mention in the statement she sent to CTV News. Canadian leaders have a responsibility to condemn hate, bigotry and white supremacy and, as interim leader of the Green Party of Canada, I do so unequivocally. This post received a score of 44,000, with an upvote ratio of 84%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Fuck white supremacists. There. It's easy. It's the easiest, milquetoast political statement to make. I condemn racism and white supremacy, so easy. And you won't lose any votes because the white supremacists would still think he was a secret racist like him, forced to hide it by political correctness. But not, he couldn't even manage that. He couldn't hide his true nature as a racist bastard. He can't not be himself. He has built his fame, his brand, on not just his name but who he is. To ask him to not be racist and supremacist for even one statement is anathema to who, and what, he is. But he has done more for black people than anyone since Abraham Lincoln. Ah ha ha ha. I think this comment gave me cancer. It's pretty close to, an actual Trump quote edit, how are some people having difficulty understanding this comment? Come on y'all. The thing is, it's a quote from a month ago by him. And he restated it during his debate with Joe. I swear he says that all the time. Another good one is, I'm the greatest thing to happen to Puerto Rico. Every time Donald shouts, record low African American U-N-E-M-P-L-Y-O-M-E-N-T. He then trots out his ridiculous line about doing more than black people than any P-O-T-U-S since Lincoln. It should be the bare fucking minimum. Every leader should be publicly required to swear to not support supremacist groups of any kind. Shouldn't we all be able to agree to hate fucking Nazis? Should that be the lowest common denominator? Should saying, I fucking hate Nazis, be in all of our hearts? My ancestors who fought against fascism and oppression would be shocked to their core with where we are today. I'm shook that being anti-fascist is considered a fringe belief. I think it is more sad that we have to even ask the question. I've never once been in a job interview and been asked my opinion of Nazis. Not even regarding Illinois Nazis? I hate Illinois Nazis. It must be nice to live in a country where your leader isn't completely batshit. Before 2016 we had that too, and we'll have it again. It's going to take a while to restore the US image with the rest of the world but I think, hope, pray, believe that it will happen. Currently sitting as the Florida of the world doesn't sit well with most Americans. This is the perfect way to put it we are all Florida, my friends. We are all Florida countrymen in 2020. Conservatives, probably, isn't it suspicious how Hillary hasn't condemned the Proud Boys either? Nope, instead if you go on our conservative and you'll see them repeatedly stating the Proud Boys aren't racist at all. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.